Hi everybody, welcome back to Bimal Sarji YouTube channel. This is problems from compulsory mathematics class 9. So class 9 students, this is the problem of taxation chapter question number 7a. Janisha is an unmarried employee in a commercial bank. Her monthly salary is RS 45,000. She has to pay 1% social security tax on her income up to RS 5 lakh and 10% income tax on RS 5 lakh 1 to RS 7 lakh. She gets 15 months salary in a year. She pays RS 30,000 as the annual premium of life insurance and gets 10% rebate on her income tax. Answer the following questions. What is her annual income? Question number one. Question number two. Find her taxable income. Question number three. How much tax will be rebated to her? And question number four. How much annual income tax should she pay? So, for this question, okay, now solution. Question number one, there is written what? What is her annual income? Okay. So, for annual income, we can see in the question, Denisha is an okay, uh, her monthly salary is 45,000. Okay, so her monthly salary you can now write here. Monthly salary is equal to the five is three plus one, eight 45,000. Okay, monthly salary. She has to pay 1% social security tax on her income up to this much and 10% income tax on her this much to this much. She gets 15 months salary in a year. Okay. So she gets 15 months salary in a year. That means that means her okay annual income. Uh, what is her annual income? There is you can now find here her annual income. Her annual income her annual income is equal to what she gets 15 months salary so monthly salary is 45,000 okay and gets 15 months salary so into 15 okay this is if we calculate this we will get now 45,000 into 15 so this is equal to six lakh seventy five thousand. Six lakh seventy five thousand. Okay, and there is no after this. Okay, question. There is no any festival allowance. You can see that there. there is no any festival allowance and no any dearness allowance is there. Okay, so her annual income is this much only. Okay, so one more question is complete. What is her annual income? Now we have to find find her taxable income. So to find the taxable income, that means the income in which tax is to be paid. Okay. So for this we have to find now tax rebate amount. Okay. We have to find here tax rebate amount. But tax rebate amount is what? Tax rebate amount is here that uh, see there um, she pays this much as. Uh, uh, annual premium of life insurance okay so here is in this amount no need to pay tax so uh, here we can find that annual life insurance annual premium of life insurance annual premium okay annual uh, premium uh, annual premium annual premium of life insurance okay annual premium of life insurance okay <coughs> there is two conditions okay in this in shortcut you can write here okay uh, don't write this long cut okay in short you can write here um, life insurance okay life 
insurance okay for life insurance there is two conditions okay one is maximum limitations okay maximum okay maximum limitation okay the maximum limitation of this uh, life insurance will be 40,000 okay and the second case is their actual premium this is our actual premium okay 30,000 so this is actual premium actual actual premium is equal to our here 30,000 CPH is 30,000 as the annual premium so this is our 30,000 and among these two okay we have to take the lowest one or least one okay smallest one we have to take so this is our list 30,000 list so we have to take into account this 30,000 okay so for this 30,000 no need to pay tax okay therefore tax rebate amount is equal to therefore tax rebate amount is equal to this is our 30,000 okay list one okay we have to take list one among these two okay so this is tax rebate amount now after tax rebate amount now we can find this two number question find her find her taxable income okay so to find now two number taxable income her taxable income is equal to her taxable her taxable income is equal to so taxable income means her annual income is this much here annual income is here the total accessible income okay total accessible income means okay and annual income is same okay so we have to subtract this okay six lakh seventy five thousands minus this thirty thousands okay because in 30,000 no need to pay tax so uh, this much minus this much okay is equal to uh, 30,000 so this will be if you subtract this will be 6 lakh and 75 minus 30 so this will be 45 so this is our 6 lakh 45 thousands okay our taxable income is 6 lakh 45 thousands that means in this much amount now tax is to be paid okay now how much tax will be rebated to her okay so how much tax will be rebated to her okay for this for this question we have to first find the income tax because see there rebated tax how much tax will be rebated rebated to her means there is given she gets 10 percent rebate on her income tax okay that means we have to find what annual income tax we have to find then only we can find this three number question okay so for this we will write now here therefore uh, tax rebated to uh, there is uh, how much we got here this much yeah so now uh, to find this uh, annual income tax we have to okay we have to split this into tax labs okay because tax labs means what this is a we got answer okay no this means we have to separate this into what five lakh because for five lakh there is what one percent says social security tax is on her income up to five lakh so we have to separate this split this into five lakh plus plus now remaining is how much there one lakh forty five thousands so see there now ten percent income tax on rs five lakh one to seven lakh so five lakh one means this is uh, one lakh there is how much one lakh remaining of okay this much minus this much will be how much one lakh forty five thousands so one lakh forty five thousand comes between this okay so for this amount ten percent income tax is levied okay so now this is our uh, taxable income in the tax lab now we'll find okay now we'll find here annual income tax so now uh, 
annual income annual income tax is equal to what uh, 5 lakh so for 5 lakh 1 percent so 1 percent of 5 lakh plus for this 10 percent okay 10 percent is between this so this is 10 percent of 1 lakh 1 lakh 45 thousand okay now uh, annual income tax is called this much so now we need to calculate so one percent means uh, in simply okay one percent means how much do you know one divide uh, one divide hundred so two zero cancel so there will be one two three zero so this will be what five thousands plus ten percent of this much means ten divide hundred so ten divide hundred will be what one zero uh, one zero and uh, one zero one zero cancel and there will be how much 10 percent means okay uh, one two so this much okay one four five and this zero will cancel so two zero okay that means this is fourteen thousand five hundred so when we add this total uh, this is our five thousand okay so five thousand means how much uh, five thousands plus fourteen thousands fourteen thousands five hundred we got how much nineteen thousands five hundred okay we got this is our annual income tax now now we can find this question number three how much tax will be rebated to her so now three number we have to find now here three number we can find now easily that tax rebated to her okay how much tax will be rebated to her so tax rebated okay tax rebated to her is equal to tax rebated to her is equal to how much 10 percent 10 percent rebate on her income tax so 10 percent of this income tax so 10 percent of this 19,500 if we solve this okay 10 and percent means divide by 100 into of means into and this 19,500 so 10 zero, one zero cancel this 0 and this 0 cancel we'll get here we'll get here 1950 1950 now now we can easily find Mm, uh, question number four how much annual income tax should she pay okay so annual income tax she should pay so annual income tax she should pay okay is equal to what uh, this much annual income tax is this much and this much is rebated amount so this is uh, 19,500 minus this 1,950 okay because this is tax rebated this much is returned okay tax rebated to her so this much minus is equal to how much subtract it uh, 19 one nine five zero zero minus one nine five zero so this is our seventeen five five zero that means seventeen thousands five hundred fifty okay uh, this is the complete solutions to this if you have any doubts or queries Feel free to comment in the comment box. You can check the playlist for uh, other solutions of OPT maths also and mathematical tricks. See you in the next videos. Radhe Radhe Jai Sri Krishna.